Tonight I'm going to make pulled pork with a Scottish twist. Start with pork shoulder. Get yourself some. Get yourself some peppercorns, salt, smoked paprika, brown sugar, mustard powder, and garlic. Stick it into one of these things, blend it all together until you get yourself a paste. Chop an onion, stick that in the pan, put your meat into it, and then put the paste over the very top. That's a stock cube that I've just chopped up at the very top of it as well. And then the important secret ingredient, 1901 Iron Brew. Pour yourself a glass, make sure you drink that later on, and then lather the entire thing in Iron Brew. Now if you don't have this type of Iron Brew, normal Iron Brew will do the job, just add a wee bit more sugar. Stick it into the slow cooker, and this is after six hours. After six hours, this is what it's gonna look like. Mix it all around, make sure all the juices are getting properly mixed, get the onions on top of it as well. Now after seven or eight hours, this is what it looked like. Took it apart, put it back into the slow cooker again for another six hours, so 12 hours in total. Now when you're ready to finally eat it and enjoy it, get yourself a brioche bun, butter it, and then get it onto a medium hot pan. Get yourself some red cabbage, shred it up finely, a carrot with a peeler and just make yourself some ribbons, mix it all together and then grab yourself some some yogurt. Do it on a bowl, do it on the chopping boards, up to you, mix it all together. Take the buns out, back onto the normal pan, I've used a wee ring here, get your full pork, stick it into the centre and warm it up on a, in a medium hot pan. You'll see it's starting to steam, we don't want to lose much of that, get some of the juice onto the top of it as well, and importantly, cheese. You've got to have cheese and then get yourself a metal dish, stick it over the top of it, and that kind of creates a little oven -y thing, and it gets everything melted. After a couple of minutes, it should be ready. Now start assembling your roll. Oh, get the juices on top of it right now. Of course, you've got to have some more juice. And there you go, cool pork sandwich with a Scottish twist. Use iron brew. Gordon Ramsay, what do you think of that? 